Right, so I have a. This is for a CRF 250 or CB 300. I have a Wasco piston here. Uh, I'm gonna weigh the stock. Actually, this is the uh, this is the uh, CB or CBR uh, 300. So the 286 actually. Uh, so I have the piston. It's obvious. It's used. It's just a little bit of oil on here. I have all the rings here, and I have one circuit clip. So I wanna actually weigh that. I obviously have some carbon build up here. Uh, so I'm gonna weigh it and see how much it weighs. I want to compare that to the uh, to the Wasco. So zero grams. This is two o seven point seven. Two o seven point seven grams. Let me try again. Two o seven point seven. Try different angles. 207.6 208 207.7 so basically somewhere between 208 and 2076 uh, right so that's uh that was with the piston the rings and one circuit clip so here i have my Wesco. It's on here. So clip in there. Rings. Obviously this one is new. Um, 221. So a little bit heavier. 221.8. The other one was what? 207, 208. So this is 207. So that's uh, 10, 11, 12, 13, 13 grams or so heavier. Two twenty one, or excuse me, two twenty two, two twenty two point two, two twenty one point nine. So basically, about two twenty two. Uh, so a few, you know, about uh, what was that thirteen or so grams heavier. Remember that this was actually this this kit here. This is a this is supposed to be the two. Uh, the 283 big bore for the CRF 250 uh, and the CRF 250 the piston is actually uh, the piston on the CRF 250 is actually heavier than the 300 piston okay so the CRF 250 piston is heavier than the uh, the CBR 300 piston uh, by a few, I, for, I forget how many grams if you watch one of my other videos you guys actually see it I, I actually compared the 300 piston and the 250 piston the stock uh, pistons all right, so that's the weight. Uh, so a few grams heavier. Let's look at the uh, let's look at the uh, the sleeve, the cylinder. So I got a cylinder here. Let me turn this sideways. So there's two cylinders. So this is the original uh, 300, and this is the uh, 283 uh, big bore. And the original 300 is actually not 300, right? It's 286 right here. So you can see 286, uh, uh, 286 cc's. And they have it in there. So I'm not actually, uh, I'm actually gonna measure the, the 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 bore here. Let's see. So right now I'm zeroed out, 0 0.00 millimeters. Oops, it's a little dirty here. Let me wipe a spot. Uh, there's a little bit of carbon buildup. So this is a use. Use one and you know doesn't seem like much carbon, but it's enough to slightly throw the uh, the measurement off. So this is seventy five point eight seven. Oops, can you guys see that? Seventy five point eight seven. If that was one way. Let me try that another way. Here, let me wipe off the carbon as much as I can. is uh, 75.93 so a little bit wider this way huh let's try this way again 
Again, that could be just the, the difference in the carbon. Uh, maybe my measurement's slightly off. So actually, while I'm in the um, while I'm in the cylinder, it's reading it's reading seventy five point nine two seventy five point nine two point nine three. So it's about the same. It's pretty square. Seventy five point nine two nine one. So pretty close. Seventy five point nine two nine one. Let's look at the uh, the two eighty three big bore. This one is 80.87, 88, 80.88. And this way is 80.95. It's a little bit bigger this way, side to side. 80.95. Compared to 80, oops, 89.4, 89.5. So pretty close. I mean, you know, calip this this type of caliber is not really meant to uh, to measure uh, uh, diameter. It's better to have the other type of uh, 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 inside diameter bore gauge. It's um, where you actually put the two together and you actually just roll it. Um, but I don't have that tool. So basically, uh, there's your difference right there. Let's see. So let's look at this. Let's look at the two. A little closer. Um, so you see the, uh, the sleeve here. Thickness-wise, you know, there's a difference. Uh, let's see. Let's do this side over here. This is. Oops. This is. Uh, 4.8 4.8 millimeters 4.8 over here seven point two seven point two four seven point two two so there's that difference See what else in here. Let's look at the back side. You can see a big difference in the the thickness of the skirt here. Um, let's see. Big one. I'm just need to pick a point. Uh, let me see point here so the equivalent would be over here so this is uh, three three oh three point zero nine millimeters three point zero nine millimeters three point zero nine this one is five point five point three five point four 5.4 millimeters. So there's your difference there. All right, so that's it. That's the comparison between the two. Thank you.